Hey guys, Hash here, and this is going to be a very quick video on controls set up for Rainbow Six Siege. Now this game has pretty simple controls, so I don't think a lot of people will uh, find this necessary, but just in case you're wondering what I think the best setup is, here it is. So you have your basic keys that are the default for the first few things here, uh, all the way up to navigate. I use a X for crouch in every game. Prone is Z. Uh, control walk. Uh, you don't have to take your hands off the movement keys if you want to slow down and make yourself make less noise. Uh, you got shoot and aim as normal. Reload. I've started putting on my mouse all the time now. I have the uh, G502 so I have access to five extra buttons uh, not including the normal ones. So reload is my uh, mouse 5. Uh, interact is mouse 4. Uh, melee, is, this is a slash, but it's actually one of the buttons on my mouse that I had to bind to a key. Um, if you don't have as many keys as I do, you can always bind this to something like F. Uh, would probably be a good one for melee attack. Uh, primary gadget, I have middle mouse uh, and alt for secondary gadget. Um, you can probably tell because I have all these buttons on my mouse or on a button that doesn't require um, you use your pointer finger on your keyboard hand or your middle or your uh, ring finger it allows you to keep moving without having to stop and use anything at your disposal so that's kind of the uh, theme that I do with most of my uh, keybind setups primary, secondary, deploy drone and observation tool aren't really important uh, primary and secondary you can get by simply scrolling your wheel up and down uh, there's no your gadgets aren't accessible by that so it doesn't really, like, you never are going to have a time where you accidentally over scroll and get to a gadget instead of your secondary. So it's not really necessary. Uh, deploy drone and observation tool, you could bind these two easier to access keys like C and V if you wanted. Um, but it's honestly, I find it, it's not really like a clutch situation where you have to access these. So it's not really important. Uh, and the rest is pretty much up to you except for ping, which I would recommend having on a very accessible key. I use F since I have melee on my mouse, but if you're using F for melee, you might put this to C or V. Ping puts a little yellow marker that counts down from three, so it can be very handy if you're in a multiplayer scenario and you want to mark somebody or you want to let people know when you're going to breach, so it's kind of important. Uh, switch fire mode is another button on my mouse. The enemy scan you're usually doing while you're controlling the drone, so actually this one I will change because usually you want to keep moving around as a drone, and we'll put that as B since I'm not using it. And weapon swap is just to switch from primary to secondary, so it's not uh, really important. If you rather not have scroll wheel on your mouse, you could set this to a different key, but I don't use it. And that's pretty much it. Um, yeah, like I said, the controls aren't very complex in this game. But anyway, uh, if you did need some help with keybinds, hope this helped. Uh, please do like, subscribe, and comment, and I'll see you guys later. Hash 439 out.